John Vibes is here to entertain you. Duncan Hinto was very much not impressed by Mark Malo's late arrival at a grand entrance on the Real Housewives of Durban and couldn't just hold all this hate to herself as she had to express this hate publicly to Mark Malo in front of all the invitees. Mark Malo felt so hurt and broken and she felt disrespected as well. But you all know what Mark Malo did. I'm gonna give you all the details in today's video as Langongo was definitely put to shame. Yes, no so didn't even imagine that Makumalo was supposed to reply in such a way but it felt like she was so bitter and Nonkanyinso felt a little bit betrayed or should I say she felt so heartbroken and depressed after what Makumalo did to her. So make sure you watch this video right up to the end so you don't miss out on any subsequent details and information. But before I give you all these details and information you are welcome to my YouTube channel. Do well to subscribe, like this video, drop a comment and hit on to the post notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of our subsequent videos. I can apprehend looking to make a ground front through being fashionably late. But Tobile Marco Malo Seleko honestly took the piece while she sooner or later rocked up at the flowery black tie affair she threw together along with her famous polygamous husband, Musa, who definitely was the main king and host of the Italian Istanbul reality TV show. For those who don't know or are not aware, yes, Nonkanyenso is Mayene's best friend and she was her maid of honor during her marriage. She as well even provided her white wedding outfit and her traditional outfit as well. And that explains a lot why she definitely has to hate Marco Malo that much because Marco Malo and Mayene really don't get along even though they're married to the same husband. Husband. But this time around, she went out of guard already as she decided to clap so hard at Mark Malo, who actually kept them waiting and came so late to host this particular party. Langongo said, and I quote, You understand I'm anticipating a few personal jets, crimson carpets, Oprah Winfrey is in Durban, or a few Beyonce has landed, or any person special. We had been invited through Tabile. I've in no way been so bored already, and Tabile keeps making the boredom getting so intensified. I really don't like this lady, you know, and most definitely I prefer it was somebody else. Can you all imagine that? Your own fellow housemates, and should I say, or should I say, your own fellow colleague in the Real Housewives of Duban definitely has to speak such ill about you. Oh, many people actually alert that Langongo was so disappointed because of the fact that Mark Malo was the one who actually took the role in The Real Housewives of Durban as definitely she wanted Mayeni, her best friend, to be the one. But Mark Malo has been the one who has always been so loved by the eyes of the viewers. Mark Malo has been loved by, I mean, a lot of people who actually come across all the wives of Musa Seleko. Mark Malo is even the most popular wife. She is the most well-recognized and known. Check her followers out, more than a million followers on Facebook and 800,000 followers on Instagram. That is to say she is loved by a lot of people and again she rarely gets backlash online unlike Mangwabe who is always on the nose because of one bad thing or the other and most definitely Marco Malo's brand is so perfect. She is very stylish, very beautiful and very attractive as well. Many people love her for who she is because she doesn't fake her lifestyle unlike a host of other women out there that if they join the Real Housewives of Durban of course they're entire lifestyles will be faked. You all tell me in the comment section what you feel and kindly subscribe and hit onto the post notification bell. I love you all so dearly. Jump vibes.